It's a 154 Cub Low Boy that is complete. It runs and propels, but I'm going to sell it. The only thing it's missing is the deck. It uh, has some issues that I'm going to talk about. Right now I want to give you a look at the cosmetics. As I do this grill, it looks really good, but I did use fiberglass and reworked it a couple years ago. I think there's one little small ding in it. The undercarriage is there for the deck, it's just the deck is missing. So if you have a deck, everything else is there. I even have the belt, which I'm going to include. The battery's fairly new. Includes the power takeoff. All right, I'm going to go ahead and start it up. Now with this tractor, what I did is I put a gas valve on it. And the reason I did that was because the carb leaked a little bit. So what I do every time is I cut the gas off when I shut it off. Okay, now to start it, I'm going to choke it. Okay, it must have enough fuel. I'm going to choke it. Right now it's charging. The engine sounds pretty good. Idles down really nice. Get back up. Get it in the nose. Couple basic things: the transmission slash rear end growls a little bit. Always has the whole time I've owned it. it. Goes into all the gears as expected. Nothing unusual about the transmission. The engine starts and runs good. Does not smoke. However, once it's at full load with a deck on it, it would it does have some blow by. So that's not going to be obvious to the person that buys it because they're going to be loading on the trailer. The last time I drove it the clutch was a little weak however I was able to load it onto the trailer so but I think it's going to need some attention and also the charging system sometimes it charges sometimes it doesn't I haven't looked at it but the last time I was running it I got halfway done with the cutting job and the battery went dead it caused the engine to not run it even includes the uh, lift cylinder for the deck all the tires hold air. The front tires are 12 inch. They're not original. The grill is not original. The headlights don't work, but it seems to me like the uh, wiring harness was there to plug it in. I just didn't want to mess with it. It also has a supplemental oil pressure gauge in addition to the light on the dash. So overall, you make your own decision, but I'm selling it as parts. Price is right. It just needs to go. I've had it for a long time. The uh, steering wheel is not original. Oh yeah, the steering's got problems too. It's pretty tough to steer. There's a lot, quite a bit of play in the steering. So make your own call, but it's mostly be best if somebody already has one and they need some parts off of this or they just want the C60 engine. Make your own decision. Thanks. Bye.